G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza and in this video tutorial, we're going to be looking at a simple way of drawing ears. Ears are interesting in the sense that uh, with most drawings, ears are pretty much the last thing on people's minds. Uh, especially when you're learning to draw, you're focusing on much more complicated and annoying things to learn like hands and feet, like uh, anatomy and muscle structure, bodies and poses, expressions and, and construction lines and all this stuff. And by the time you get to the ears, you just kind of blah, that'll do. You just scribble some crap on and, you know, anyways, <laughs> what I have here is a representation of a photograph of an ear and, uh, and I've drawn some lines as to where the ridges of these ears pop out and how I, that can be converted into a two-dimensional drawing. Now this is a more complicated way to go about it. This is very anatomically correct. Now if you want to draw anatomically correct ears and really, you know, make sure that, that I mean, even some sounds dumb saying that. Wow, those ears are really anatomically correct in that drawing right there. People don't really kind of bother with that stuff. So what I want to show you are two kinds of ears that I draw, a more realistic or comic book style ear and a very cartoony style ear. And I find them really simple and easy to repeat and I use them in most circumstances. And I just wanted to share that with you. It's nothing too fancy or crazy, but I just thought it'd be nice to have a, a little video showing that. Plus I got request, it was a request in, uh, in the comment section. So here you go. Here is your ear tutorial. So on the left, I'm going to draw my more comic book style ear. So I do this round shape and then I extend it down and then add a little earlobe. So you don't want to make it too prominent there. And then we have, uh, that, that's our outside line of the edge of the ear. Okay, so if the face is in this direction, that's the way I start. And then I begin the line about halfway towards the back edge here and make it thin at first until I drag it around like that. Okay, so that's how it starts. And then it pops in like that and then that line is done, okay? So I've got this outer shell and then this inner ridge and then I just add two internal little spots in there, okay? So I know that's not 100% anatomically correct, but I guarantee you people aren't gonna notice and it's really easy to remember. I'll just repeat that again. Da 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 How easy is that, okay? And then the other type of ear I do is the very cartoony kind of ear, super simple just a half circle that kind of folds in a bit more to itself and then bring the other inside around like this and then add an inner ridge like that. So it's like, it's almost like an extended number six without the bottom half. Okay, so we have this outside C and this inverse unfinished number six. And that's how that ends up. And I just have two contexts in which to show you how that turns out. So we've got these two character faces and uh, as you can tell looking at these they look pretty much finished ears are such a secondary thought process for for people viewing something or uh, drawing something so it's nice to be able to have a method uh, and you can create your own I'm just showing you the one I use uh, that you can rely on consistently because let's face it most ears are pretty much exactly the same so method on the left here with this slightly more comic book character style I draw the proportion of the outside of the ear, angle it with the face, then I begin the inside line, have that inner bit pop in like that, and then I draw my two little hubs. And that is how I draw an ear. And it looks completely natural in that circumstance. And with this character on the left, it's as simple as the ear shape, and then my inside other little line work thingy that I do. Really simple and a really short tutorial, but uh, you know, it's always worth having little tips and tricks to share with people as well. So uh, make sure that you uh, learn your own styles of drawing ears. I hope this, is, this has been an extremely inspiring tutorial for you. Now, you go and practice drawing all your ears. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoy my videos. You can download the reference files from this tutorial by clicking the link in the description. And remember to share any art, animation or game you make on Newgrounds.com. Until next time, see you later.